մտնամ ին արդեն գյուղում էր, ու մուտ նկավ ոտքով ճամպա անկանք, գիշերով ոտքով առանց լույս երեխաների հետ ճամպա անկանք հարևան գյուղ։ We are miraculously saved people, said the teacher from Artsakh. Laura Abrahamian, who was forcefully driven from occupied Artsakh, told the journalist that when Azerbaijan started war in 2020, they left their village and came to Armenia. After the war, they returned to Artsakh again. We returned to Artsakh with great expectations, and we couldn't even imagine that such things could happen again, and we could leave Artsakh again. We came back to Chankatakh and started working and continued our way of living. We had a fear, as our village had become a border village, and our boys often were given number one and were gathered. There was a fear, but we continued living with hope, she said. Laura worked as a mathematics teacher in Chankatak Secondary School. She also described the way they escaped from the village when the enemy started war again on September 19th, focused on the peaceful population as well. We were at school. We had already gone out at one o'clock when the enemy started shooting from different weapons. We were very frightened. The children were with us. We could hardly get to the nearest houses and hide until it calmed a little. Half of the children were driven into the next village. We were expecting that we would be next. We were very frightened. The children were with us. We could hardly get to the nearest houses and hide until it calmed a little. Half of the children were driven into the next village. We were expecting that we would be the next to be driven, but after four or five hours, the enemy was in the village. When it became dark, we started our way with the children. After walking for two hours, we decided to stay in the forest. We stayed for two to three hours and continued our way. After walking for five to six hours, we got to village Vartazor. We stayed there for the night. It was eight o'clock in the morning when we were told that the enemy reached Vartazor. Again we started walking, again through the forest. I don't know if we were frightened or not, I can't explain how strong we were, but we could overcome the difficulties. We are miraculously saved people, she said. <laughs>